Did you know not a single Pokemon Go trainer reached level 40 until three months after the game's release, and to this day, many trainers are not even close to this momentous level. This is because it takes 20 million XP to reach this level, and back in 2016, the average trainers barely gained 5,000 XP per day, meaning it will take them 11 years to reach level 40. Oh, how times have changed. Over the years, gaining XP became easier and easier with plenty of new methods of collecting XP being released. And well, today we're gonna be taking advantage of this, setting myself out on my biggest challenge yet. Hit level 40 in under 24 hours. Ugh, and what better way to start a 24 hour level 40 challenge than on the floor? First things first, let's create the account that we're gonna be taking to level 40 right now. We're gonna click new player here. And there you go, that was very easy. And here we go, I haven't started a Pokemon Go account in so long. Here we go, Professor Willow. Okay, Professor Willow, I don't really care. Let's go female for this. We're gonna go with the noob set. I think it'd be cool if we look like a complete scrub, but we're level 40. And here we go, we have to choose our starter. The most important thing of the day, we're gonna go with Squirtle. Squirtle was the OG starter I chose and getting our first excellent throw to start the day on our starter, let's get it. And there we go, the journey begins. Level one. Oh, I can't check the IVs, I forgot. Okay, thank you, Professor Willow. We're gonna choose our nickname, and we're gonna call this account 40 in 24. I know it's not that creative. Cool nickname, thanks, bro. <laughs> I didn't know you liked it. And the spawns are in. Okay, so game is on, and there you go. First level up, level two. Now the challenge begins. So here we go, I'm gonna start a stopwatch. Now, we've officially started the challenge. Time to go. We gotta get catching excellent throws. Let's hop on the bus and head downtown. Run, 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 go, 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 24 hours. While we wait for the bus, get Poke Coins, because we are going to need Lucky Eggs going the whole time, and I'm gonna explain why in a second. Now you see, the reason we need Lucky Eggs the whole time is because of this. Check this out. Excellent throw. Check this out right here. Look how much XP, don't mind the first catch of the day, but 8,000 XP just for the excellent throw. And LeChonk in the Pokedex, which is amazing because all these dex entries are gonna be getting us extra XP. A regular catch, 9,360 XP for an excellent throw. We currently have a four times catch Starus event, which means we just got all the way up to level eight with those two catches. And that's how we're gonna do it. You need 2,500 excellent throws on four times catch XP with a lucky egg to hit level 50. So all we gotta do is hit 2,500 excellent throws and, and we're in there. So that's the name of the game today. We're gonna start heading downtown now. Pretty much just focus on hitting excellent throws and we'll see if we can make it there. Now there's one problem I'm gonna have during this event that probably not a lot of people are gonna think about, and that's gonna be Pokeballs. So what I've done here is I have a auto catcher connected to spin Pokestops for me, and I'm probably gonna have to buy some. <laughs> Yeah, I know, buying Pokeballs is one of the worst things you can do in Pokemon Go, but during a challenge like this, it's our only option. So we're gonna start off buying 800 Pokeballs, see how long that can last us, and hopefully our bus ride into town can stock us up enough because we're gonna need at least 2,500, and that's if I don't miss any excellent throws. Anyway, let's get back to grinding. Or should I say another level up? Yeah, I'm leveling up so fast here, I'm actually skipping levels. I just went from level eight to level 11. The one thing to note is these early levels are gonna be a lot quicker on the level ups, and it probably won't start slowing down until level 30. Pretty much every excellent throw I hit, I level up. Update. Level 13, I don't know how many of these I'll do because I think we're gonna get a lot of them. <laughs> Another update, level 15. This might be the fastest someone's ever hit level 15 in Pokemon Go. It literally took 15 minutes. Okay guys, I've ran into an unseen problem. Level 16, but also item bag space. You only start with 350. I'm gonna need a lot of Pokeballs at once, so this might be a little bit annoying. It means I can't really spin stops. So I'm gonna upgrade my bag to 1,000 storage. Luckily enough, we have no Pokecoin cap for this challenge, but this is something I did not consider. I need space to hold all these Pokeballs we're gonna be catching all these Pokemon with. And here we go, level 17, literally almost halfway to level 40 in under an hour. Again, it's so easy to level up early, but whatever. And there it is, officially halfway to level 40, level 20. This is when things will probably start slowing down on the level ups. I've only caught 29 Pokemon. I've hit 29 Pokemon caught and level 20. This event is insane. Okay, I can't miss the bus, I gotta catch it. Another level up, level 22. I'm gonna start updating you guys every two levels now, just cause it's happening so fast. And then we'll go down to one level once we're past level 30. So far, a 55 Pokemon caught. So doing pretty well. But again, we're gonna need to get that up to 2,500 minimum to end the day. Um, guys, 
Did I not choose a female character? Did my character just change to male? What the? Okay guys, officially up level 24. We're going well, but it's really hard to hit excellent throws on this bus, so we're gonna be hopping off in a second. Okay guys, we're officially off the bus. The spawns are looking good. Now the real grind begins. Let's get that XP. Okay guys, another level up. Definitely starting to slow down, but level 26. We're doing well, about 145 catches, especially an hour in. Now I did the math. If I wanna do this probably pretty easily, getting 1 million XP per hour will get us there pretty easily. And we're about 920,000 XP. So honestly, feels pretty good. Only about 19 million XP to go. It sounds like a lot, but you get a million in an hour. Not as crazy as some might think. Okay guys, um, I kind of missed the animation, but update level 28 right now, sitting at 1.3 million XP in a about an hour and 20 minutes. Overall, very happy with what we're doing right now. There's something else I wanna do to make this go even faster. Let me find a spot and explain it. Okay, so this season we get extra XP for hitting friendship bonuses. If you don't know, there's three friendship levels, good friends, great friends, ultra friends, and best friends. And while good, great, and best, we don't really need those because they take multiple days to unlock, good friends gets you 4,500 XP non lucky egg and 9,000 XP on a lucky egg, and it only takes one interaction to unlock. So what I'm gonna be doing is calling out to you guys in the community posting my trainer code and trying to hit good friends with as many people as I can. 9,000 XP times the 40 gifts I can open every day. That's an extra 360,000 XP plus the gifts other people open. Overall, it's free XP I gotta take advantage of. So I'm gonna post my trainer code and uh, hopefully some people will wanna help out the boy, you know? Help out the kid. Let's keep going. And look at that, the community has come to our aid. Over 70 friend requests. We're gonna add all these. Uh, but yeah, huge shout out to the community. Wow, that's crazy. And look, here you can see, like look at this. All of these people who opened our gifts, that's all 9,000 XP. So XP method number two is working flawlessly, but we're about to get picked up by a local group here who are also doing a 24 hour challenge. So huge shout out to them. But other than that, the excellent throw streak continues and keep at it. Okay guys, so we're here in the car with Poseidon, Poseidon and Fixer Slayer. Fixer Slayer. And yeah, they have graciously offered to let me join their 24 hour grind. So we're gonna get to it. We're gonna be still hitting those excellent throws. We're at level 29, about 2 million XP. So pretty, pretty good pace so far. Let's just keep going. Okay guys, and officially another level up. Level 30, which means we're only 10 levels away. It might not sound like a lot, but the last 10 levels, level 40, is actually where the most XP is needed. So I'm happy with this, but we still have a long way to go. Okay guys, for the first time, we've hit the max Pokemon storage in this challenge, 300 Pokemon caught. So what we need to do now is we need to transfer them. Now, luckily we can search for four stars and we don't have any. This will be safe transfer, but we're just gonna select all, transfer them all, and uh, keep catching, because we don't really care what we catch today, we just care about XP. Okay, we are officially level 31, another level up. We've been going through these insane grinding routes with so much XP. Let's see if I can hit one with one hand. No, I cannot. So I'm gonna focus and go back playing with two hands. And the first shiny on the new account is going to be a level one shiny hop -ip. Let's see if we can hit the X and throw on it. No, we cannot. Oopsies. All right, it is fine though. One shiny so far, about 500 catches in. So all just looking pretty good. Wow, we're getting pretty lucky with the shinies. Shiny number two is gonna be a shiny Fletchling on the account. Let's see if we can hit excellent this time on it. No, no. Third time's the charm. There you go, second shiny on the account. About a 500 catches, keep going. Another level up, level 33 in Pokemon Go. Only seven levels to go, the hardest seven levels, but still, I will take it. XP, we're about four million XP in two hours and 57 minutes. Three hours, four max XP, we're killing it. Okay guys, and another level up, level 34, which is amazing, six levels away from level 50. So far, the excellent throws have been absolutely great. And also, something I forgot about, we're getting so many new Pokédex entries, which also just helps us get more XP. The more XP, the better. Okay guys, we're gonna do a time update here. It's current. Currently 12.07, and we got ourselves our third shiny on this account. The new account is pulling in all the shinies. We're about at 5 million XP, which is great, and officially about three hours and 40 minutes into the challenge. So really, we're just killing it right now, uh, and we're gonna keep going. And there it is, level 35, another level up, five levels away, let's go. Okay guys, so we are officially four hours and 17 minutes into the challenge and we're about to hit our thousandth thou, a sa, thousand Pokemon caught in the account. Let's see if we can make it an excellent throw. 
there we go, excellent throw. Now obviously not all of these Pokemon I caught were on excellent throws, I've tried my best, but I will still gladly take that. A thousand Pokemon caught, again, we need around 2,500 excellent throws, so we're almost halfway-ish, kind of, not really, because we need they need to be excellent throws, but whatever, we're gonna keep going, a thousand Pokemon on the account. Level 36, four levels to go. We're doing pretty well, we're doing a little restock here, because we're kind of running out of Pokeballs on the account. If I gotta buy something, I do still have 5,000 extra coins, so it shouldn't be too big of an issue. Back to the excellent throws. Okay guys, the time is currently one, my hair looks crazy, but like any 24 hour challenge or challenge that takes a long time, you gotta take a break. So we're gonna go grab some lunch right now and then we'll get back to the grind. And while I'm on break, I'm gonna open gifts as well to try to get the XP from that. So we're not gonna be completely shutting down, but we will take a little bit of time. Let's go do it. Okay guys, so we're here waiting for lunch and what I'm going to do now is I've added a bunch of people, 400 people, shout out to people who added this account. We're gonna simply just search Interactable and we're gonna open all these gifts. Each of these gifts will get us 9,000 um, XP each. So opening 40 gifts, that's 40 free, you could say excellent throws. So we're gonna do this while we eat lunch, get a bit of XP. Free XP. That's where we had lunch. Not a bad spot. And the sushi spot's pretty good down there. So, sick. Now we're gonna hop back in the car. We're about 8 million XP, five hours in. Feeling pretty good. Okay guys, update here. Level 36 with about 8.1 million XP. We're currently five hours and 13 minutes into the challenge, so at a good pace. To be honest, if we can do this in under 12 hours, that would be absolutely insane. So we're really gonna focus up now, see how many excellent throws we can hit. Let's get to it. Okay, so for anyone who's wondering what I'm doing, because it is very repetitive, I wanna show you guys pretty much what I'm doing. Literally this. Excellent throw, nice. Excellent throw, nice. Excellent throw, nice. Yeah, it's that simple to get to level 40 in under 24 hours in Pokemon Go. Just brings up the question like, is XP too easy to get now in Pokemon Go, or is this how it should be, rewarding players who are good at hitting excellent throws? I'm very curious what your comments and what you think about this. Anyway, back to doing that more and more. Okay guys, we've officially hit the next level, level 37, which gives us only three levels to go. And this also means that we are not at 10 million XP yet, I thought we were, but no. We have 9.7 million XP, so we're about halfway now. And it's only been under six hours, so I'm very confident we can do this is actually under 12 hours. We're gonna continue grinding, continue pushing, focusing on those excellent throws, really doubling down. But yeah, like literally, level 37, and we started today. Like, that's just, that's just crazy. We've also gone 14 kilometers in there, which is a lot. Nice, good job, Dax. Okay, big news, 38. That means we're officially two levels away from level 40, but I will say we're nowhere near done because these are the hardest two levels to get to. Yeah, so our total XP right now is 12 million, which means we have about 8 million XP to go, 3 million for this level, 5 million for level 39 to 40, but we're doing pretty well, and the time is only almost seven hours in. So yeah, we're, we're killing it right now. We're gonna keep grinding though, see how close we can get. Maybe we can get it before the sun even sets. That'd be insane. Okay guys, we're on our way grinding up to level 38 right now, and we got ourselves another shiny. And shiny number four for this account is gonna be a shiny abusal. Make sure we get that X and throw for that extra XP. I'm very curious how many shinies we're gonna end up with before we get level 40. And will we catch a hundo before we hit level 40? Level 40 without a hundo would be pretty crazy. Let's keep grinding. It is officially 418. We're really close to level 38, but me and the boys, we think it's time for a break. So that's what we're doing here. We're gonna hop into the Starbucks or some sort of coffee shop. Take a little relaxing time, but I see us completing this challenge in the next couple hours, two or three. So yeah, we'll take a little break and then I'll update you guys when we're back. Okay guys, break's over. Got some iced coffee, we're back to it. I'll update you when you hit level 39. Okay guys, big news, level 39, let's go. That means we officially have one level to go. We've actually only been playing for eight hours and 13 minutes. 39 levels in eight hours is crazy, and I think we can do it in under 12, so we're gonna keep pushing here. Excellent throws will continue to come in. Hope we're gonna hit level 40 soon. I'll look at you guys when we're near. 
really closing in now. We are officially 3 million XP to go. We're at 17 million XP. If you don't know, it takes 20 million XP to get to level 40. And something you'll notice, we still haven't chosen a team, which is gonna be a big question to do at the end of this video. And we also still don't have a buddy, which is really funny. Level 40 without a buddy, without a team, it's about to happen. Okay guys, got ourselves another shine. We got Nat here. If you wanna say hi, if you recognize her from the stereotypes video. But we got ourselves a shiny LeChonk. That makes five shinies on this new account, about 2.5 million XP away from level 50. Let's see if we can hit X and throw. We cannot. Another shiny though. I'm very curious how much we're gonna end with at the end of this grind. Okay guys, the time is currently about six o'clock, which gives us about two hours left, but we're pretty hungry. So we're gonna go ahead, take a little lunch break, grab, or I guess dinner break, grab some shawarma here, and then we're gonna head back out. We're only 2.5 million XP away, so I'm pretty sure we can hit it, but uh, see what we can do. Level 40 in under 24 hours, under 12 hours is pretty insane. Anyway, let's get some food. Okay guys, the time is currently 6.32. We're officially 10 hours into this challenge. XP 17.7 million, which means you only have 2.3 million to go. I think we can do this in under uh, 12 hours, no problem. So we're gonna get back to the X and throws. Update you guys, I guess, when we hit level 40. And the time is officially now. As you can see, we are at 19.992 million, which means one more excellent throw is gonna get us to our mark. So let's see if the lights can turn off on us. Lights. We got a Quaxley here. Let's see if I can do it. I cannot. Let me try that again. Houndour, come on, be the last throw. Bang, Houndour, which means when we back out of this, come on, come on, just show me, just show me. What are you doing, bro? Level 40 in, hold up. What's our timer at? Let's pause it. 11 hours and seven minutes. Absolute insanity. Let's run through a couple stats before we end this video because I'm sure you guys are curious. In terms of startups, we got 1.278 million. That's crazy. Could have been even more on a star piece. I did not use star pieces. In terms of other stats as well, we caught 2,800 Pokemon, which means I hit about, I think I missed about 300 to 400 excellent throws, which is not that many miss. This is actually not bad stats at all. Hitting this many catches in 12 hours is a lot. If I kept going, I could do 5,000 catches. And yeah, that's a lot of catches. There's one more thing we got to do in this video, and that's going to be choose our team. As you can see, we're still on Team Harmony, which is the team that is not chosen. But I'm going to give it up to you guys to choose the team. In the comment section below, I'm gonna put three comments, Instinct, Mystic, and Valor. Like the comment of the one you want the most. The comment with the most likes is the team I will be joining on this account, and you can officially claim 40 in 24, which we should actually change. I should change it to 40 in 12. Nonetheless, if you want this person on your team, hit the like button of that comment below, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Level 40 in 12 hours. See you in the next one. Bomber Disney, buddy. A peace. By the way, shout out to Poseidon for helping us out in this video. Also, Fixer and Matt. Bye.